how to become an Azure data scientist. My name is Caio Moreno. I'm a senior cloud solution architect and Azure data science at Microsoft. Today I'm going to present how you could start. Many people come to me and they ask, Caio, I want to start with Azure. I can see Microsoft's growing so much and I'm very excited to learn Azure and I'm a data science and I want to use the Microsoft tools to um, implement my, my machine learning projects and I want to use Azure. How do I do that? And other people come to me and say, I don't know about this, the topic. I don't know about the field. I want to start from scratch. What should I do? So people are starting their careers. They're just in the university and then they, they're eager to learn and they come to me and they ask me by LinkedIn, by email, or they, they, they ping me um, in events and they ask me this question. So I, I want to create this presentation to help you you that is already a data science and, and is already familiar with all the topics and you just want to move to Azure. And also for you that wants to start your career as a data science and you want to jump directly to Azure. And maybe for people that are in other fields and they want to learn as well, and they just want to have some background and overview about uh, Azure data science, data science and how to become one. Okay, so the easy way to start is if you go to Microsoft Learn. So Microsoft Learn is a portal that Microsoft created that has many different courses. They are for free and you just have to create an account and you're gonna have access to that. So just go and click on the link below this link here and when you click you will go directly to the website so your azure data science journey could start here this could definitely be the starting point for you so i'm going to show this portal later and tell you how you can uh, customize to your learnings but then the second question people ask is okay kyle i am i'm spending a lot of time in microsoft learn I am doing all the exercise, I am reading, and I'm very excited about that. And I really want to do work with data science. I want to do something that can prove to the market that I'm ready to go. And it doesn't mean this person is a senior data science. This person could just be in the starting of the career. But definitely, what are the things that if you do, maybe you will show to people that they, they should trust you and they should give you the opportunity to start. So especially if you are in a company that is already at using Azure and you want to get more opportunities around uh, data science projects. So I will recommend you to definitely to test your Azure data science skills uh, going for the certification. So uh, there are many Azure data science certifications, but I'm just gonna focus on just one. And I think if you want to become an Azure Data Science, this should be your first uh, focus. You should focus all your energy to get DP100, the Microsoft Azure Data Science Associate certification. And to know more about this certification, you just have to go and click here on this link, Docs, uh, and then you see. So this certification will try, will test you, you test, you test your data science knowledge and your skills, and especially in Python, using Azure Machine Learning Service. So I've done this certification myself, and I really recommend you, if you want to start in this field, you should go to the certification and, and invest your time and energy, and, 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 of, and maybe your money in case your company doesn't pay you to take the certification, uh, and, and do this certification. So, I'm also going to do an Azure Machine Learning demo in another video. Uh, I'm going to present more about how is the tool and how you could use it. So now let, let's just go back to uh, the portal. So as you can see here, as soon as you click learn.microsoft.com, you will see the Microsoft Learning Portal. So Microsoft Learning is where everyone comes to learn. So the first thing you do, you click Explore Learn and you will see uh, this website. So if you click Browse All Path, 
you see there's a lot of uh, uh, path that you can take. So maybe if you're entering for the first time, just going to create a, a new private window. And I'm going to click Microsoft. Uh, I'll, go, I'll, go, I'll, I'll bing that. OK, so if I put Microsoft. Microsoft Learn. Uh, you go to this portal here and then you click Explore. Uh, and then you you see there's the certification path, right? And there's also roles. So there is one row here that says data scientist. So when you click data science role, you will see you're gonna have like uh, your courses and even the the certification. So if I click here, I can go to the certifications, and that certification I mentioned is this one, the Azure Data Science uh, Associate. And you can click here on download certification skills outline. And this will show you what you have to know to pass the certification. You need to know how to create an Azure machine learning workspace. Uh, you need to know how to deal with data objects. So we have to register and maintain data stores. You need to create and manage data sets. You have to know how to uh, create a compute instance. And you have to know how to run your train and train your machine learning models. And all those things you have to know to become an Azure Data Science uh, certified professional. So uh, when you want, when you wanted to do this certification, uh, the first thing I will ask you to do is to go to these online free courses. So the first one is like create machine learning models, like create no code, build an AI. So all those courses they're gonna help you to to get ready for this certification. The certification costs you this in the United States. Uh, if you are in the United Kingdom, you're going to pay uh, this amount of uh, uh, pounds for the certification. So going back to here, uh, I'm going to show you one example. So this course here has like five hours. So it says intermediate. So you can go and go to things like beginner, for example. You have like foundation of data science that you could do it. Uh, and this foundation of data science will go will give you like many different uh, models and then you click learn the data science methods for example and then you give you all the introductions and all the content that you need if you want to skip that you want to go directly to the tool you can maybe click and start here and like creating machine learning models so you can click on this part here for example that you show you with python and then you give you exercises that you can try by your own. So to do that, you need to create your Azure Machine Learning Workspace, and you need a you need the uh, an account. So you have to create create your Azure free account. You just click Start for free, and then when you click Start for free, it will direct you to your portal, and then you click Create One. And then you create your new account. And as soon as you have your account, you'll be able to log into the portal and, and, and do the all the exercise that you need to do. So I'm gonna stop here because my next video, I'm gonna show you how to use uh, Azure Machine Learning Service, uh, this service here. So if you go to Azure, Azure, dot microsoft dot com uh, this uh, website has uh, the service that we have and and there is like AI and machine learning and there is one service called Azure machine learning service so this service is the enterprise grade machine learning service for building and deploying models faster so I recommend you to have a look in this video that explains more about Azure machine learning also um all all the other videos that you have here and if you are already familiar with some languages developing tools and framework azure machine learning allows you to use jupyter i most of the times we use jupyter or visual studio uh, i'm also use uh, r and python to develop my my code so you can use python and you can use r and you can use frameworks like uh, skit learn it's very famous uh, you can use TensorFlow and you can use all the other 
uh, uh, frameworks that uh, is uh, very uh, important in the open source data science community. So here are some of the key service capability the Azure Machine Learning Service has. And also there's some books in case you wanted to, to learn. And you can click here in Mastering Azure Machine Learning and it will direct you to this page. And when you put your, your data, uh, you're going to get you're going to get this book. So I really recommend you to download the books. So even this one and this one uh, and and also try the service. So there are many tutorials and like beginners and advanced and videos and customers that are using Azure Machine Learning, some customer stories. So you can find uh, all the materials that you need in the website. So uh, I'm just going to stop now and I hope you like it. And I hope this video can be the starting point for your Azure data science career. Please uh, feel free to reach out to me, send me your feedback, your comments and the things you want me to improve and always happy, happy to uh, share my knowledge with the people that want to become Azure Data Science.